Hey everyone, Not Free Mama here. Today I'm going to show you how to make St. Patrick's Day Rice Krispie Treats. Okay, let's start off with our ingredients. First, you're going to need six cups of Rice Krispie cereal or any other kind of off-brand or crispy cereal. Then we need 10 ounces of mini marshmallows. I'm using the fruity, but you don't have to do that. You can just use the regular mini marshmallows. Three tablespoons of butter. And then if you want to tint them green, you're going to need some green food coloring. And then, of course, some kind of shamrock or four-leaf clover cookie cutout. And that's all that we need. So let's go ahead and get started. First, I just lined um, a big cookie sheet with parchment paper, and I'm just going to set that to the side. Then in a large saucepan over here, we are going to melt our butter and then add our marshmallows and just stir them until they're combined and melted. All right, my marshmallows are almost completely melted, so I'm going to go ahead and add in my green food coloring. All right, that looks good to me. So I removed um, my mixture from the heat, and now I'm just going to fold in my Rice Krispie cereal. All right, that looks nice and combined. You really want to take your time on that part just to make sure everything's incorporated. So next, we are going to put this onto our prepared pan and just press it down. And you may want to use your hands for this, so go ahead and spray them with cooking spray first. All right, my mixture is all pressed down. I just really pressed it down with my hands and then along the edges, I just kind of go like this to really make it firm. And then I added some sprinkles to mine. You don't have to do that. I just thought it would be cute. So I added these light green, the sanding sugar, and it just is giving it like little shiny specks everywhere. So now I'm going to go ahead and put this in the fridge for 20 minutes to set up. All right, my Rice Krispie Treats came out of the refrigerator, and I was able to get seven, but my cookie cutter is rather large, and it just depends on how flat you push them. And then you've got all these yummy leftovers, but you can definitely eat those. And the um, rainbow-colored marshmallows just make it them really fruity, and I'm so happy with the way they turned out. So I can't wait to see what Taste Tester thinks. All right, I've got one of the Rice Krispie Treats here for Taste Tester, so let's see what he thinks. Hey, taste tester. Have a little taste. Okay. Damn, that's good. Do you like it? Yeah. All right, everybody. Come back and see us again. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Yeah, like and subscribe. Bye. Bye.